My name is John Kunda. I come from Zambia uh, in Southern Africa. I'm involved in community-based uh, research. Uh, that's what I've been involved in for a while. I've, I've taught before uh, master's level students. But, um, you know, as understandably, I come from a region where HIV AIDS is an hyper epidemic. Uh, it's a pandemic. I mean, it has reached pandemic levels. I come from a country where the prevalence is about 14.3 percent. It's a double digit. Uh, it is unaccept unacceptably too high and um, something needs to be done about it. Other countries have managed to reduce their HIV prevalence to single digits. I have lost friends. I have lost relatives as a result of HIV. So HIV is not just a story that I read about in books. This is what I've seen every day as a human face. So the big question that I ask myself is how do we get them involved? How do I get involved in mitigating the impact of HIV? And uh, since I'm passionate about research, I've been involved with uh, CIET, Community Information for Empowerment and Transparency. And they are community-based uh, researchers involved in pragmatic clinical trials. My project currently is looking at uh, non-ignorable data. Why is it that people don't answer certain questions in the communities when you're conducting research, especially on HIV prevention? Why is it that certain questions are not answered compared to other uh, questions? And how do we deal with those uh, missing responses from communities? That is important for data. It's important for, uh, for, for, for robust and uh, having clear uh, answers to some of the critical questions in HIV prevention. And that is what I'm working on. And CTN has provided an international post-doctoral uh, fellowship. And uh, Lehan, Professor Lehana Tabani is the one who is uh, supporting me here as an international supervisor. And uh, Dr. Anne Cockcroft is supporting me as the local supervisor. And the aim, again, is to find, is to develop a tool to deal with missing data in community-based trials. Mind you, I'm coming from a situation, from a country where predominantly we are community-based. The individual is defined within the community. I am because the community exists, and it's a community that defines me. Therefore, the community is a critical factor in mitigating some of the factors that impact on HIV transmission.